is I, Lester Cabell. <laughs> and Gurf. Please be advised that the Trinity Squad podcast is an immersive audio experience. It may seem like sounds are coming from the sides or behind you. This content is suitable for all ages, but does contain violence. And songs. And now, get ready for Trinity the- Squad Podcast, created by Sterling Suleiman. You interrupted me. Yeah, that was on purpose. What are you doing sneaking around the tower, little lady? Please, please. (laughs) My transport crashed. I'm just looking for my sisters in all the snow. At the ice tower of Brune. In 20 years of watching the tower, Uh. no transport has ever come. Whoever told you to venture Uh. all the way out here must not have liked you very much, squib. (laughs) (laughs) No, please. I'm helpless and scared and perfectly dainty. You know what? A brat like you could go for quite a lot of coin in the dark, Sam. Mm. How about I sell ya? Hey, does your sister look like a mohawk axe holding warrior who can do one-arm pull-ups? Mm? Or an intergalactically dialed-in technological savant? Uh. <laughs> That's exactly what they look like. Guess I don't need to lie to you anymore, big guy. <gasps> Ouch! I'm Lyra. Oh. The oh, incredibly right. gorgeous uh, and equally fierce sister of the Trinity Squad. Oh, We're about oh, to break into the Ice Tower of Brune. Oh, <laughs> you lied. That's all you got from that? Yeah. They popped out of the snow with weapons. You'll never get in the tower, squibs. You think? Because I could take you with one hand behind my back and... Oh. Ah. One X. Meanwhile, I'd be shocking you from all the way over here with my zap. <laughs> Made it myself. I did the outfit. One must always play a part. But check this out. Not hair clips. Yeah. Knives. (laughs) Good night, big guy. (laughs) For a guy with three eyes, he really didn't see that coming. They never do. I love being underestimated. Get his keys. Let's get inside, find the egg-like relic, and hightail it back to the junk shack. Easy cheesy. Pumpkin sneezy. Uh, by the way, Digit, you can't look like a savant. Makes no sense. You're just jealous because the zapper gun I invented is stronger than your axes. Roll him over. I hit him first. And who needs a zapper gun when I have these guns? Oh, (laughs) slug! What? Did Digit forget deodorant again? That was you. Oh, right. I must have lost my earring in the fight. Jam, I love these earrings. Honestly, Lyra, they were a little extra for the mission. Um, uh, not for me. If I'm going to be the dainty damsel in distress, I'm going to look cosmic doing it. Found his keys. Here. Got him. Let's go. Wow. A green comet? Whoa, never seen Uh, one of those. The whole sky is green, and I can hardly see what I'm doing. That would be the green comet of Muzz. Comes by every 100 years with its distinct green color and three-pointed tail. Oh. Digit, light, please. Why are there so many locks? Doesn't anyone trust anyone anymore? Hurry up. This place gives me the chilies. You give me the chilies. I know you feel small in my presence, Digit. I'm sorry, what was that, Raz? I I just can't hear you up here with my higher IQ. Can you two cool it for five minutes? I'm trying to focus. I am known for my silence. I love being quiet. Ah, Got it! Okay, it's showtime. So... Marv said the egg-like relic should be in a secret room downstairs behind the display of heads. Ew. Did Marv mention the two-headed Zorgle that would be barring our way? If done in the breakdown, you guys can handle the Zorgle, right? Our pleasure. See you soon. I call the head with a fang. I'll deal with Mr. Barbed Tongue over there. Five coin says, I get my head first. Teamwork makes the dream work, Raz. Let's split this Zorgle in half. Gotcha. Stay in the flow. And know when to go. (laughs) 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 (laughs)
This was nice. Up. Oh. Okay, here we go. Oh, yuck. There's my wall of heads. Hey, that one looks like Raz on a good day. <laughs> yeah, sweet burn, did it? Oh, thank you, did it? All right, all right, focus. If I were a sneaky bad man, where would I hide the secret switch to my nasty head case display? Hmm. Scanning, scanning, scanning. Ah, simple pimple. I guess I probably wouldn't think anyone would get past my three-eyed guard and two-headed zergle, so I might put the relic... <laughs> wow. In plain sight. Let me guess. Glass case with a trigger wire? Ugh! Gate. Locks. Hey, bad man is by the book. I will be taking this egg-like relic. Uh, thank you very much. <laughs> Good thing I constructed my very own laser blaster, or what would a savant like me do? Oh, digit. You're simply amazing. Ha! Get up! Back it into the corner! I'm letting it come to me! Seriously? Ooh, these will work. I got it! Happy now? Simple pimple. You guys done playing around? Relic and tow. Let's boogie. Calling our junk boat. All in. Impulse! Let's blow it up! Marv said don't do any damage unless there was an imminent threat. So... Oh no! What's that danger? <laughs> <laughs> yeah! See you never, Ice Tower of Broom! <laughs> right! <laughs> girls will be girls! Drive us home, Lyra! You bet! Oops! <laughs> Sorry! head around this, ladies. What part of the breakdown said blow up the nab-fanging tower? It was not in the breakdown. The wall of heads I did find. And we swiped the egg-like relic. Bang, boom. Why the bristle up? Why the bristle up? They're asking why the bristle up. <laughs> we are a small operation of scavengers. Half of what clients pay for is for us to keep it quiet. So we got half the money, ladies. Because now, thanks to that stunt, there's heat on this. These clients don't fall out of dead space. My job is not easy! I don't know, it seems easy. It's not easy! That was the warden's doom tower! The cog will come to inspect! You don't get it! A little egg-shaped relic goes missing from their stash. Who knows? Could be an inside job. But the whole building blows up? Huh? What do you think? I need some slurk. It feels like a targeted attack on the cog, and there's only one way the cog punishes. Death. Slavery. Banishment. That's three ways. <laughs> you all think this is funny. No, yes. no, we don't. <laughs> but Marv, we felt an imminent threat, and we had to act on it. Imminent. Soup's imminent. Well, you better hope the cog doesn't know who did this, or there will soups come here and soups skin us alive. Will that be four ways? <laughs> You're all on shack duties. No more runs until I know the space is cleared up. Up, up, up. I don't want to hear it. 
Hit the shack! Ugh, it's so hot. Uh, yeah. Next time I want to blow something up, remind me of this moment. Ugh, Galaxy Cog Report incoming. Good day, citizens, creatures, and free people of Miracula Galaxy. It is I, Listica Bell, your Galactic Cog Radio host. <laughs> and it's me also, Gurf, your other host, Speaker Man, circulating the day's announcements, adjustments, and super random agendas of the Cog here on GCR. Yes, it's both of us. And some I... exciting news is Muno Stars, the cosmic crooner of tuners, will be giving free concerts across Miracula Galaxy for what he says is a tour to reintroduce himself. <laughs> that guy never stops. So keep your eyes, gills, horns, and whatever's ready as the details spill out, you lucky Miraculans. Thank you, girl. Muno Stars! Woo! Smack me! We have to go. We know all of his choreo. If there's one thing we've been training for, it's this. Impossible. Marv will never let us leave Turg for anything but a mission. Man! Now, due to several fires in the Orno territories, taxes will be increased to patch up the damages. Whatever was the cause of these fires must be expensive to exterminate. <laughs> if I may, I think you mean extinguish. Do I? You've got to be kidding me. Everyone in Miracula is starving as it is. Remember, Miracula Galaxy is united under our Incellus King. And while 20 years ago, during the war, his creations, the Spilo Machines, were used to disintegrate entire civilizations and beat the galaxy into submission. <laughs> That again. Oh, they sure can, Listica. And boy, are those Spilos nar nar. My uncles all died in that war. I had seven. Yeah. A friendly reminder that the massive robot killing machines are still patrolling our planets. I wonder what really happened on Orno. Too bad we weren't there. I could have blown something up. It's a 10% increase starting today. Have a miraculous day! 10%? Ugh, the cog sucks. Uh, understatement of the era, the cog killed all the children born the year the Encellus King took the galaxy because of some dumb, dumb doom prophecy. The prophecy of doom. We'd all be dead if Marv hadn't swooped us up after the war and hit us here. Killing babies feels like a real harsh way to protect Miracula. Here we are anyway. Heretic scavengers raised in a bar on a dusty old meteor called Turg. I think we turned out all right. Yeah. Hey, thanks for not ratting to Marv that it was me that blew up the Tower of Broom. Come on. He knows. Digit. No problem, Raz. Squad first or you're the worst. Yeah. Squad first. But Marv seems so pissed. Oh, whatever. It's fine. Marv will put us back to work in no time. We don't have any proof of that. What? We always accomplish the task at hand. We are the best, so Marv needs us. You'll see. And no one will come looking for us because we left no trace. Raz blew up the evidence. We're good. Simple pimple. Is that a fleet of cog tracker ships landing in our airstrip? Yeah. Ah, slug. to episode one of the Trinity, the Trinity Squad, Squad Podcast. Podcast. You took my line. Starring Yasmin Suleiman as Lyra, Carly Hughes as Raz, Ozioma Aka as Digit, Sun Krishpala as Marv, Lana McKissick as Listica Bell, Ryan Garcia as Gurf, and Sterling Suleiman as the Henchman of Broom. Created and written by Sterling Suleiman. Artwork by Vanessa Fattel. Song mixed by Christopher Gibbon Harrison. Sound editing by Sterling Suleiman. And music and sounds provided by Envato Element. A special thanks to everyone who has donated their time and 
talents to make the Trinity Squad podcast. <laughs> I guess that's us. Well, for you it was just time. Tune in next week for episode two, Shiraka Has Landed. Follow us on Instagram at Trinity Squad Podcast. And please tell your family and friends to come check us out. See you next time. In Miracula Galaxy. In Miracula Galaxy. Mm-hmm.